So this afternoon, I had to <laughs> soak it in eggs and go with us. <laughs> what else could you do? You must keep this place open. I know, I just hope we ate eggs at this dam. Understand, she's not still... Oh no dear, she's long gone. But sometimes when the moon is full and the wind is blowing, I swear I hear talking back. See, Eden, this is me and my dreams. Why, Miss Peabody? Do you think Grady and Agatha will be with us tonight? No, Carlotta. No, don't tease. No, it's just that the roads are so bad from the storm today that I couldn't get go to the bank to deposit a check. I stored it in a secret hiding place. I know I'll be safe there, but all the same, I'm nervous. A secret hiding place, like under the banner in a cookie jar? Now, JT, I've said enough for already. It's been a secret passed down from day to night. All I can say is, I hope she's quiet if she comes to haunting. I've already had enough trouble sleeping lately. Why, Carlotta, why don't you just borrow some of my books and read until you become drowsy? It always works for me. Well, it doesn't take much to make you drowsy, but yeah, sure. Well, if you'll all excuse me, I think I'll say goodnight. Goodnight. I think I'll turn in as well. Good night. I'm going to stay up and read a little longer. I think I'll stay up for Seymour or Dr. Brown. Now, what's this? Some budding romance? Oh, Carly. <laughs> Good night, darlings. Good night. Good night, everyone. I'm a little tired, too. So tell me more about this device. It sounds fascinating. Let me see. 